Hey, this is Frank and it's whiskey time again, single malt time. And you know, everybody has their favorite. My favorite always has been McKellen. I love McKellen. I buy them wherever I go. I try and get some of the travel specials as well. And that's what I'm going to speak about tonight. This is one I got. I travel all the time. I think before the, the lockdown now, I was in 12 countries in about two months or three months. So this is one of the ones I bought, and it's, it's got a beautiful picture on the front here. So this is the Macallan Whiskey Makers Edition, Nick Vesey. Nick Vesey, I believe, is a photographer, and there's about six of these in the collection. So uh, nice box. Let's see what the bottle looks like, and more importantly, my favorite taste of Macallan. As you can see, I've been drinking this one. Nice color, sort of beautiful golden color you can see there and again I love that picture very unusual over there McAllen and this one is about 42% proof last night was 60% man oh man that was something else it burned down the throat but this one I think might be a lot smoother so uh, let's taste it and see what we've got Beautiful colouring there. Oh, take a look at that. That's just gorgeous. Oh, nice. Exciting. That's it's one of those where you can't wait to taste it. Fresh fruit, spices, definite spices over there. A bit of ginger as well. Toffee. Oh. Mm. That hits the spot. Some whiskies, some single malts just do it for me. They just hit the spot. And so far, I haven't had a bad Macallan. And this one's right up there. I love this there. Explosion of fruits in the mouth over there. Lovely lingering taste. Almost leaves that tingling sensation on, on the top of your palate, on the back of your tongue. Just that warm, tingly feeling there. I taste a bit of ginger there. Orange, definitely some orange. A bit of chocolate. Spices coming through strongly. This is a real fantastic single malt. There's some real good ones in this. This one is great. Mm. That just slight explosion, tingling sensation at the back of the tongue. I love it when I get that. If I don't, it's too smooth. If I'm drinking a single malt, I want to know it's a single malt. Oh, the top of the palate there, just tingling away. A bit of a smoky aftertaste there. Spicy. Almost like uh, I've had some orange marmalade as well. Oh, this is just a lovely, lovely whiskey. And that's why that level is coming down dramatically. Now, I can't remember what I paid for this one. I buy so many in the different airports. But I, I should imagine it must have been around 80 bucks. So I, I can't really comment on the value. But uh, as a single malt, definitely a 9. Absolutely a 9 out of 10. One of the nicest ones I've got in my collection. So, hey, this is Frank. See you next time for our single malt review. Cheers.